so hey guys welcome back to my channel my name is Sharitha and today we're going to be filling one of my vending machines at DHL uh, before we get into anything else I'd like to say a big thank you for all the support all the comments all the subscribing and all the sharing so thank you guys for all your support um, today we're going to be filling one of my vending machine at DHL um, so this vending machine is a Sorrento 3000 it's a combo machine an amazing Chinese vending machine I do own about four Sorrentos so you know they're working out good for me um, yeah so today we are here filling it up I was last here a week ago and as you can see we have empty trays and that's what every vendor would like to see so all the tray only consists consists of coca-cola um but i believe we ended up um we ended up being short of coca-cola yeah um so i do like this um i do like this location i've only owned the um the location for about two weeks now it's a great location average is about hundred and fifty dollars a week which is amazing um, it could I could take it longer but the problem is it has a really really small machine I've just talked to the bosses and they gave me a go-ahead of putting in a vending machine but now my question to every one of you guys is would you put two small machines in one locations or would you just bring in a bigger machine so please let me know what would you do and my other question would be is um how long does it take you to fill your vending machines or how better um how can i do it better like um how fast can i do it or do you do it so I can you know I could also pick up so if you have a channel as well and you know you do it faster than me just let me know I will follow you I'll check out your channel and see how fast I could do it because I'm sure this um, this vending machine takes me about probably 25 minutes so yeah the video is cut a bit short um, just to facilitate time and everything that goes in to make the video as well just so I'm not boring to you guys as well um, I believe I'm stunning I'm standing ooh, I can see a little bit of my shoe there I am um, I'm standing right next to the machine and I'm thinking what should I put in next because I'm running I ran out of coca-cola and I still had cup of space is missing um cork so yeah that happened and i would like to say guys is how do you get um better locations better locations i do have um at this point i do own about 10 machines and um 10 machines and seven of those machines have card readers on them but hey it's a business so i'm looking for more more locations so if you guys know how to get into big locations or locations that coca-cola already owns i'm always happy to go have a chat with those guys and say hey look this is how far how better i could do it um consistent i'm reliable i am always happy to drop in and refill the machine take care of you guys as long as you take care of me as well um yeah so i ended up putting um yeah i ended up filling the pepsi marks and i was one too many so i ended up putting the one the one that i had um back to where the one that i was missing from coca-cola
and I had run out of um, Kit Kats. Yeah, so guys, it's 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 um it's summer in 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 Australia or in wh- where I come from in Australia um, in Queensland. So it gets really really hot. Like um, it's about forty five degrees. It's delicious, guys. It's delicious. Um, so it gets really, really hot, right? Um, and because my van, my little van does not have a, an air con at the back. Um, or I don't have, you know, a a freezer or anything like that. Because I have not only just started up, but then I'm trying to put every single dollar the business makes goes back into the business. So yeah, that is happening. Um, most of my chocolates are ending up um, really melting melting really bad and I only put them in there when I'm going for the route but by within two hours of me driving because most of my vending machines are two hours away um, by the time I get there you know they're all mate melted so I would like to say a big thank you for you taking you know the time to watch my video or getting this point of the video um so as you can see my channel is about vending it's all about vending that's all i do i loved i love i love my job i love my vending machines i love my business i love everything of it so the content i produce is all about vending um so if you'd like to see some more vending videos please um check the description um the video please subscribe share the video um please leave me a comment down below on the questions i've asked um let me know how fast you fill up your vending machine let me know how i could do it better to save a bit of time and let me know um what i can do to improve you know, not only with my vending machines, but um, with my YouTube videos as well. So thank you very much, guys, for watching, for subscribing, for commenting, for sharing in advance. I do appreciate all your help. and Thank you very much. You guys have a blessed day. We'll see you soon.